So what we've got here is a 52-inch deck, Ferris, uh, commercial-grade mower here, uh, 25 horsepower, 724cc, um, runs pretty well, and uh, just got done dragging the ball fields. And yes, another cool feature with this lawnmower brand, it has the hitch thing so you can hook things to the back of it. Um, it does pretty well on this sand. So yeah, I got done just um, dragging this ball field. Got two others to do. Um, another cool feature, it comes with a light there. It's on 24 seven, so you, there's no on and off button for it. Um, but we did add our own lights to it. And yes, I'm sorry, it's always muddy. It's not pretty good in mud. Of course, not anything's any good in mud. But we added our own lights to it. Is it on this side? Nope, it's on the other side for that. Yeah, here. So, it has a little switch right there. So, another thing is, is this. Whenever you're going by, like whenever there's a tree or something like that on the, on the on your path to mow, if you're too lazy like me to get up and pick it up and move it, you push this forward, but not the full way, because if you push it forward the whole way, this, the whole deck stays up, but if you just push it forward enough to have the deck come up, so you can just go right over the uh, tree branch or anything, you can just release this, and then you can just keep mowing. But then here's all these, all of those, um, uh, Another good thing is, is I use this up in the woods. Um, the deck goes pretty far up, so whenever I'm going over stumps, it doesn't really hurt the deck. Um, <sighs> not really much else to say about it, but it's a pretty good mower. Um, I think I've gotten, oh yeah, a hundred. Look at that. 125 hours on that thing. And less, and I got 125 hours on that thing in less than two years. I bought this thing last year about for seven grand. Um, yeah, that's how much I put on it. So I would recommend getting a Ferris lawnmower, but uh, Cup Cadet's okay, but I'd rather, ready, 